This is Sean Monson. He is the filmmaker of Earthlings in Unity, and we're at the pig vigil here today at Farmer John's near LA. Where, what brings you here today, Sean? To bear witness. Yeah. To bear witness of, uh, I don't eat animals. Uh, and most people who do eat animals don't want to see their food before it's food, which is really weird. If you if you bought a new camera, for instance, because I'm here shooting, you might want to know all about it, how it works, and how to make it run optimally. Right, let's see. And you think that the people who do eat animals that put food in their body will want to know more about what, what they're putting in. Even when you take your car to the gas station and you pull up, there's three different types of quality of a fuel, you know, you want to, you want to pick the best the best food. I mean, the best fuel. So, so anyway, um, but people don't want to know about their food. They don't want to know about their food. So you come, you come and you bear witness to this and you see it. This, this is the animals going in to be slaughtered. They're killed within the hour or so of arriving here. You're sharing the same space. It's extremely powerful. It's not violent in terms of blood and guts. So people that are, are, are squeamish about that, you can't you can't recreate this experience without coming and bearing witness. That's why I'm here. Yeah, that's why I came too. Can you just tell us a little bit about the ten-part documentary you have coming up? It's going to be similar to Earthlings. Well, that's it, it's a it's a we pitched it. We haven't yeah. started it yet. We're uh, looking for where where we take it to, and it would be uh, just like Earthlings was, but instead of a feature-length film, it would be a, it'd be a ten-part miniseries, so um, each, one episode about pets, one episode about food, one episode about clothing, entertainment, medical research, sanctuaries, food technology, the environment, wildlife. Um, so it's an episode that, it, uh, a documentary series broken into episodes, so if you as an activist were talking to somebody and, and fur came up and said, you know what, you should watch episode five. It has everything you want to know about that, or, or if it's about the environment, you got to watch episode three. So it's also geared to, uh, as a teaching tool. So hopefully we'll find a home for it and get it started. Oh, yeah. Thanks for coming here today, Sean. No problem. Happy to be here.